Welcome back. I'm Carl with Targets with Attitude. And today I'm taking a look at another new knife from CRKT. This one is the Quattro. Rather interesting little knife. It was designed by Richard Rogers of New Mexico, who is the same man who designed the Maven. Uh, if you saw my video on the Maven, you know that... Uh, Mr. Rogers is a cattle rancher, and if you didn't, well, now you do. Um, so he designed these to fit what he and his ranch hands figured were the most important things they needed in everyday work on the ranch. Rather nice little knife. It's got G10 handles. Um, nicely done up. Got almost a wood grain appearance to it. I love the uh, pivot points here. Those are just really nice looking. Pocket clip, unfortunately, cannot be moved. It's not a problem for me because I carry right hand pocket tip up. But uh, if you want something else, well, sorry, this one is not movable. But you don't have to clip it onto your pocket, of course. Blade is 8CR13MOV. Rather nice little spear point. It's got a good belly on it. Um, very elegant design. Very simple, very plain, but very comfortable in the hand. It's a little smaller than the Maven. It's uh, four and a half inches closed. The blade is uh, just about three inches, maybe a touch over, but not by much. I think the uh, sheet that I read on it says that it's uh, 3.2 inches in length, so. But it is a liner lock, very pleasant. It got a little bit of a... Uh, tab on the liner lock which makes it a little easier to get a hold of than some but it's perfectly smooth in spite of that which is interesting most have some texturing as always CRKT just does a really nice job with their assisted opening so let's see how this thing works right out of the box uh, standard battery test. Of course, we'll start with a piece of paper. And yeah. Everything I'd come to expect out of TRKT. Very, very smooth. So let's go on to a piece of corrugated cardboard. Um, pretty standard corrugated cardboard. As you probably can tell from the tape, it from a box that shipped from Amazon. Oh. Okay. That takes a little bit more effort than I was anticipating. Still doing a nice job. Tip is beautiful. Um, I think the Maven is a little bit better at opening boxes than this thing. But that's okay. Um, it still did the job without any real problem. Hang packaging test. Standard Coke bottle. Tip goes right in. And yeah. Can't complain about that now, can you? That was fairly fast work. Okay, now if I can just get my hands to work. That was my hands, not the knife. So, that works real nice. Paracord. As you never know when you might need to cut some cordage to wrap a package or put up a hammock or tie down your tent or just tie something down to the roof of your car. 
nice and smooth. Muller screen, still nice and smooth. So now we'll get to a little tiny loop. Here's the real test because it's too easy to pull this loop out of your fingers if the knife isn't good enough. Find enough tip that it gets fairly full, far through, but you know, I, too. Yeah, it's just. It's cutting it, but it's taking a little bit. Um, yeah, I might want to work on the edge of that uh, tip a little bit if it was mine but considering everything else it's doing I'm not sure that that's that big a deal so piece of wood yeah, I've already cut some feathers in this piece up here but okay Feathering that up nicely. So, of course, I'd expect that from a knife designed by a cattle rancher. So, fairly impressive. Let's go back and try the paper test again just to make sure that carving on wood hasn't damaged the edge in any way, shape, or form. Still, beautiful so so there you have it the new for 2018 quattro from CRKT a rather nice little knife um, for my purposes I'd like a little longer a little edgier tip but then again I opened up a lot of packages for what it's designed for though really you can't beat it it's really really nice very smooth very comfortable in the hand and very elegant so and not a bad price point either. Um, <coughs> I'm asking right around $49 on the website. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm asking a little bit more at knife and gun shows, but then again, on the website, all I've got to pay for is storage and shipping. Um, with gun shows and knife shows, I've got to pay for transportation to the show, um, pay for my trailer, well, the insurance on my trailer, pay for the tables at the gun show, pay for food and like. So, yeah, you have to charge a little bit more. But, you know, either way, a fairly nice price point for a very nice, elegant knife. I still really love the look of that handle. I mean, that yeah, I've always been partial to wood, and the fact that they managed to get a wood grain effect with G10 so nicely just really appeals to me. Maybe it doesn't appeal to you, but it does to me, so. But anyway, enough. You got a little bit of a look at uh, this knife. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something new, and I hope that, as always, you'll keep on watching and learning more about other new knives. In the meantime, I got to get going, so you take care of yourself. I'll wish you all the best, and remember, if you're going to do something, no matter what it is, how minor or how major, if you're going to do it, do it with attitude. See ya.